yes hello everyone uh, in this video we are going to talk about uh, basics of authorization procedure and responsible for uh, EMA so EMA is uh, responsible only for uh, centrally authorized procedure medicinal products so the core activity EMA performs always they will focus on centrally authorized procedure products they don't more focus on uh, other authorization procedure like uh, mutually recognition procedure or you know nationally authorized procedure that might be their secondary objective but uh, they don't uh, focus on that because there is a separate team uh, which uh, they worked and they will take care of that uh, CMDH so that is called uh, coordination group for uh, mutual recognition and uh, decentralized procedure so this is at national level they will take care uh, you know all the activity EMA for now uh, we will focus on EMA like uh, centrally authorized products alone they will take care and uh, when they are giving the authorization there is a mandate that uh, there are certain types of medicines they that means it has to go it's a compulsory that they need to take only the centrally authorized procedure approval only example like any uh, human uh, immunovirus means HIV for AIDS uh, uh, any medicines or any other uh, therapy if they have uh, uh, you know innovated uh, something uh, they have to go only for uh, if they wanted to launch in uh, EU, uh, means EU they need to go only for centrally authorized product like this there are uh, cancer medicines and uh, diabetic medicines uh, like uh, neurodegenerative medicines or if you note some autoimmune disorder medicines or any viral diseases or any advanced therapy if you are going to perform or any orphan drug so these are certain examples where it has to go only centrally authorized procedures only they won't go and give for you know any mutually recognition or you know uh, de that is called decentralized procedure or uh, you know any nationally authorized procedure we can see about authorization procedure in a separate uh, video you can uh, you know uh, you can go and you can check in my uh, other videos where i would have talked up uh, i would have explained about only the authorization procedure uh, so the take home message for this session is uh, just ema would focus on centrally authorized product and there are certain uh, product list thank you